yes what is up everybody hello welcome to today's review we have got sh figots tian shinhon and Xiao su uh from the the new release and uh gotta say looking not too bad we'll we'll have to check it out but before we do wanted to let you know that i stream on twitch every monday tuesday and thursday 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can follow me over there at twitch.tv forward slash the Compton underscore live. And uh, if you'd like, you don't have to, but uh, you can join the Discord as well. Links in the description for all of those. And then also, we have got Moich in the description. So, guys, we have got a re release. I don't want to say a re release, a new absolute figure of Tian Shin Han. Or just, I'm just calling him Tian. You know, that's. I don't, I don't, I, I feel like I know him enough to not have to call him his full name. So cool with me. Yeah, it's, it's fine. It's fine. So looking nice in the box. Window shots looking great. He got his little buddy Chiaotsu and, uh, I have to say this is what makes this release special is just we're getting an additional character out of, out of the box, articulated additional character. And, uh, I think that is signs for things to come. If that makes sense, you know, like who, who else, who else could be, who, who else could be paired together? Like Deborah and Bobbity. Mm, yes. Yes. Anyways, looking really nice. As you can see, we have got Bandai Tomashi Nations Dragon Ball, the Bandai toy shop. It is something, it is a web shop exclusive, meaning that this came out. It is one and done, and that's about it. We have got the Toei, the gold color, and uh, letting you know that this is a Japan release. Don't believe it's out in the, the U.S. states as of today, which is Dragon Ball Super Chapter Drop release uh, October 20th, 2021. And, of course, Tomoshi Nation's quality sticker seal of approval. As I said already, window shot looking really nice. Product shucks looking really nice as well. You got the Tiana, you got the Chao Tzu. just yeah. Uh, and then back over here, just, ooh, okay, let's see, see, I, I like the fact that they didn't just give Chiaotzu just like a little square, they gave him two, two, two squares, showing that he, he, he matters just as much as the other, so not too bad, so let's, let's just go ahead and get him out of the box. And there they are out of the box. And it looks like we have got one, two. Three pairs of interchangeable hands for TN with a, an additional hand right there. And you've got two pairs of additional uh, wrist parts or uh, interchangeable hands for Chiaotzu. So not too bad. Also, three interchangeable headpieces for TN. So. This is a pretty solid release. So for about $80 USD, you get two figures and a decent amount of accessories. So not too bad, but this is this is all window shopping. Can't even tell what the figure's about. And also did want to let you know that this is going to be a review slight comparison. We are going to bring the old TN out and just Put the boys against each other and see see what's up, see what's going on. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this review. As for articulation for part one, uh, TN can look up about that much, not too bad with the neck joint. Look down like that, which is fan friggin' tastic. Uh, can do a T pose wingspan about like that. Looks just look, looking pretty good. This little uh, this little sleeve over here, a little bit of a hindrance, but not too much. Um, we got some ooh, ooh, okay, some not so not. Oh, okay, that's a that's a little nerve-wracking as far as bicep or uh, as far as a butterfly joy goes But it, it's it's okay now. I did notice that this is all he can do uh, when it comes to double jointed arms right there is uh, because his biceps 
are so large. Look at them. They're so big. Oh my God. Okay, anyways, so ball joint within the wrist like so. And then obviously we got the bicep swivel right there. Uh, and then going down to a little boop. Ooh, nothing, nothing on that ab crunch right there. And I think I would like to point out that it's probably due to the cummerbund, uh, which, okay. And then limbo style, what? In God's name, Cumberbund, you have Bener Bener Benedict Cumberbund, you have stopped us once again. I uh, can turn like so, like that, and that's a little weird because you thought it, you think it would be like his hip that's moving, but it's actually like the whole, it's the whole hip. I thought it would be the abdomen. Uh, now moving it about like so can do a twist about that much, and same thing about that much. Not, not the most nimble TN figure I've ever come across, but you know, it, I guess he's, he's, he's just, he's always like a power poser, like, and um, now I got the, got the, I want to say these are updated uh, when it comes to, to, to the, the thighs there, but can do a split about that much, which is, oh God, that is ugly. What is that? That's not a split. That's a split that I can do. Let's just, yeah, that's, that's a split that I can do. I can't even, I can't even give you props for that. Can kick up about that much, which is very, uh, what, Tian, I like, I get it. You're the power poser, but still. Okay, it, obviously we've got the, the, uh, thing, the, the split right there, but then, now going down to his double jointed knees right there, it seems like, they just, his legs are too bulky, too big. They're not moving too high. Uh, and then can, oh my God, TN, what in the, oh, oh, can't, can't do much at all, buddy. What are you doing? And then, okay, here's, here's a redeeming factor. Toes can point down about that much, can point up about, okay, uh, a little, ooh, okay, okay. Look at that ankle rocker pivot action. Is that because like you're good at getting stuff broken? I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. And then, <gasps> two pivot action. Yes. Okay. So that's, it's really the only thing he's got going for articulation. <laughs> so that is, that's kind of sad, man. That's really sad. Okay. And moving on to Chinese little vampire right here. Chiaotzu uh, can look up about that much. Pretty okay. Look down about that much. Eh, not too bad. Uh, no, 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 uh, no ab crunch. No, no, like hip, hip, hip swivel. Nothing about like that. No butterfly joints either. Uh, ball joint for the arms. A very tiny boy. Um, can bend his arms about like that, which is sure i guess okay and it's it's basically an articulated uh statue is what i'd say now when i got him out guys i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna say this right now you see those legs those legs are ugh, shaky at the best and like i split him like that a little better than tn okay cool 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 double jointed knees which is surprisingly well done for the the size of figure that he is uh no no um no little toe pivot action there but he does have a little toe and does have a little foot that goes back and forth like so uh and then uh ankle rocker sure it's just a ball joint that kind of lets it do whatever now what i was saying though was this right leg popped off and I could not get it back on. It almost looked like it was assembled poorly. Um, but I was able to, I was able to punch it back in there, but like it's, it can move up about that much, which is not, that's, that's not very attractive there, Chaosu. And then can do a decent split like so. And we, we already saw the regular split. So as far as articulation for these guys, Oh, is it weird to say that Chiaotzu almost has better articulation than than uh, than the full full fledged figure? Because like the bicep the biceps on on Tian hindrance like they they stop right there. That's that like actually it's like that right there. That's that's where he stops because of his bicep is so big. Uh, ab crunch 
shouldn't even be there really because you can't even move it back thing no no limbo style nothing that that a split is atrocious like look at this I can do T and split. Let's just be honest. And uh, the knees very, very stiff and also not, like not, not too, not too flexible when it comes to that. So that's a, that, 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 that. Yeah, 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 yeah. all right. Full paint apps and sculpting for T in. Um, so as far as the the sculpting here, I don't really see too much shading when it comes to his skin tone. I do see that the cut is a lot more, it, it looks a lot more filled in and I do like the attention to detail when we come over here to the shoulder piece right there. It, the, the cut, the cut follows the line there, so that's very nice. Now, moving on to his sash though, or whatever you want to call this. Uh, pretty good pretty pretty good i see a lot of very nice just shading on there you got the dark you you got the dark coming out and just like accentuating the actual details of of that thing right there now i don't see any shading right there on the wristbands and then cummerbund just plain red which is fine nothing nothing really going on the back as well now going down to this T in crotch shotus. Uh, you can see there's shading in between on the 2.0 areas right there on the hips. Going down to his thighs, uh, nothing there, but then moving to his knees. <gasps> What's that? I see more shading and uh, looks pretty good. I'm, I'm always happy when they have just a little bit of shading. Just just don't just don't make it start colors you know just the whole figure does not need to be start colors and i'm glad that they took a little bit of extra time just to do this now going down to his little his little michael jackson uh wrist war or like ankle warmers there it, they're just yellow nothing really going on right there and then shoes eh they shoes they shoes now chinese vampire okay so honestly chaozu chaozu's uh paint apps are Pretty good, pretty, pretty, pretty good. Like, holy crap. Okay, so the, the eyebrows are fantastic. The eyes look really great. The um, the the little Chinese vampire um, right there looks great. The red ball is perfectly shaded with the the, the cummerbund belt right there. Uh, wristbands looking good, they're fine. Uh, no shading on the boy whatsoever, which is okay. He's a tiny little articulated statue is, is what I'm going for on this now uh, the pants there pants uh, not glossy but they are kind of shiny but it's not too bad and really can you shade black uh, especially on such a small figure no you can't so paint apps and sculpting for the boys the boys are back in town with this and uh, I gotta say not too bad. Not too bad on the paint apps. Yeah! Moving right <laughs> along to accessories. Look at the stark contrast of the original release and the newest release here on the left. Original release doesn't even look like TN when you when you actually compare the two. Like the, this just it's it's smaller, it's more narrow, it's not angular. The it's it's crazy. Now the eyes on the on the the newest release are they're 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 very nice, angular, very, very nicely done. Uh the 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 third eye on both look pretty good. The anime eyebrows are crazy on point when it comes to uh newest release compared to this one. It's good, it's good, but they don't wrap around. And I do I think the the circular angles uh that the, the new release there uh, like actually help with the eyebrows they they wrap around the whole thing and uh looks great now the and uh, the looks like the what is it original release does not have a morty mouth and on uh, in between the little eyebrow furrow right there and then on the newest release morty mouth all all a plenty and then the underlining around the eyes are a lot closer to the eyes giving it a better look this is you can tell it's an old figure, honestly. You really can. And um, I do love 
love the improvements on these headpieces. Okay, so here's something new. Uh, the, the newest Tien release there on the left doesn't really look like he's got a smile. It's more of like a, like a, almost a grimace. Uh, now, I do like the lining around the, the mouth there. It gives it some character. The Morty mouth in the middle there, and then the underlining the, around the eyes look really great. Shade, the, the, the angular lining for the eyes, the pupils, and the sclera, the white part of the eye, looks great. Uh, the eye for the, the third eye for the, the newest release is uh, closed, almost giving it an angry look. This, this looks like... <laughs> he just he just had some coffee <laughs> honestly OG release looks like that third eye had some coffee um also you can tell that so they're both supposed to be quote unquote like smiling grimacing something of the nature i don't see any veins on new release tn which kind of sucks because he's known for having a lot of veins just showing them off <laughs> uh, like that and um, now going over here to the OG release this, and this is kind of fun for me because I never got to review the OG release so here, here's a chance there um, it's a it's a more defined smile you can actually see he's having some fun there um, anime eyebrows looking good no Morty mouth underlining around the eyes is okay uh, the eyes are a lot more squinty but it's giving it it's it's lending itself to the smile there so I don't know if you can really compare these two pieces as far as what they're going for. The the OG release, definitely more of a smile smirk. Uh, the, the newest release is more of a kind of like a pain, pain grimace almost. So that's, you know, it's different. It's different. And um, honestly, Tien's best when he's in pain. <laughs> Holy my god. When I was putting these together, I was like, I like the yelling face from the OG, but my fucking god. Look at that new release TN yelling face. Cell, second form cell, that is what you wake up to every day. You know it is. You know it is. Wow. Okay, loving the veins there. The veins are pretty symmetrical on both. I will say, though, that the uh, the newest release here does have an extra vein that goes right there. You see it right there? Bow, bow, bow. Um, over, over to the OG. No, no extra veins there. Uh, so, also... The the uh, the OG release doesn't. Uh, it looks like almost the rock eyebrows kind of got switched over on both sides. The the OG release is it's it's more cocked up here compared to the OG release. It's more cocked over here. Uh, so also like. It, you can totally tell the difference uh, in the in the uh, I would say the eye the eye the third eye is really good on both I would say the third eye is better on the newest release there the angles on both of them look really good they give it that very nice yelling face Morty mouth in between the the eyebrows right there on the newest release is Ooh, that just just adds all the flavor that you need now obviously this like I said it's an older release we get it we're not harping on it but I'm just showing you the differences no differentiation in the mouth for OG release you go over here to newest release differentiation sit high. you got the, the the pink right there you got the the pink uh, tongue which is just a little bit of a different shade of pink but it gives it that much more character and man this is a really really good faceplate cell i'm i'm sorry bro that that's nightmares for you i get it i get it don't worry about it okay this was another hard one to compare but when you're when you're looking at the 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 concepts and what the the faces were going for i guess they make sense og release I love this face. This is the this is the face I normally have in in my display case. Right now I have him yelling because his little buddy's dying on Nappa's back. You know it's it's a thing. Canon, of course. Uh, now the the newest release almost has a question puzzled look on his face. Like my five hours worth of tri beams didn't 
didn't take this man out. It was just kind of like a back back massage, really like a very a very intense back massage is what he's he's coming to find out there. A loving loving the angles on the eyes for the the newest release there. Uh, it also got a little bit of a, a do you smell a rocked eyebrow right there, and then the mouth is so small, but it gives it that question look, and I, I do like that over here. Very very cartoony. You know he just got his hand cut, knocked off by a fist. No, but no, no, no blades. No, no, no destructo discs. Just a fist. A fist knocked your hand off and that is the face that you're going to make. And I get it. Uh, the, the anime eyebrows look really good. And I don't know if I already said it, but the morning mouth in between on the newest release is, it, it just adds that much more character. So also... Also, if this was, this wouldn't be a extremely in-depth comprehensive review if I didn't show you one of the coolest things. And you know how I said this was a confused, baffled face? 100% confirmed right here. Look, sweat mark, nervous, nervous. Five hours of, of tri-beams, not working. Overall, Awesome, awesome face plates, awesome accessories on uh, on Tien here. We're not going to show Chao Tzu because he comes with no accessories, no interchangeable face plates or anything like that. Just hands. Speaking of hands, yeah, you know what it is. We got the fisty fisty cuff hands on Tien, and what? Oh, Chao Tzu, look at you with your fisty fisty cuffs. I got my hands back. Oh my god, and we got some distressed hands. Uh, they can also be kind. Of, uh, Tien doesn't do a Kamehameha. But they, they they very much do look like Kamehameha hands. Well, eh, the fingers, not so much. Fingers usually are like this on a Kamehameha. This is just, I huh, got my hands back. Then we get the, the standard issue key blast hands and he's still confused. How did you get your hand back? I get it, buddy. And then over here, move over, move. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Chaozu with some, I would say they're telekinesis hands. This is what he's known for. And honestly, for the size there, look, okay, if you want to look at the size there, look at that. Can't even, can't even cover Tien's bicep. So very tiny, but honestly, they look pretty good for the, the size that they are. Dodon bros for life. Okay, we got the, Tien's got more of a, a little bit of a different angle than you got over here. You got Chaozu with the straight up Dodon Ray. So looking very nice, Chaozu. Good job, Tien. Yeah, you're right, cool. Young Hova, baby. Uh, probably, probably the wrong thing. Now, these are the Tri-Beam Hams, which are fan freaking tastic and i know what you're thinking it's just like why did why did he call him fan freaking tastic like they're they're just mm, hands well well fellow viewer i i've got to show you here right there see see that little hole that is there and then you've got this little notch that is over there it makes it to where he can perfectly align the tri-beam and i really i i appreciate just the small little details that they do on this so fantastic fantastic tri-beam hands <laughs> all right t n and chaotsu stand at a bow it looks like was that six <laughs> Six inches at the top of Tien's head and then going three, three inches uh, for, for Chaozu. And then we got 7.5 meter centimeters for Chaozu. And then also looks like around 15 and a half centimeters. So Chaozu, perfect, perfect. Tien, I don't know. Let's find out. I don't know if you can see that or not, but, um, OG release TN looking a little smaller there. Uh, yeah, that's the face I would make too. If a, if a re-release or an updated figure came out of me and then it was up like just a little bit off there. Uh, as you can see, it is just a weensy bit off and it might be, might be because of 
the size of Tien's head? <laughs> Honestly, I would say the, the new release has a larger head. Yes, the other one looks a little longer and a little bit more slim, but I think that's I think that's what's causing the uh, the difference there. So weird. Now Z fighter montage. Not not really a montage, just like a Holy crap, it happened. Look. Z fighter pose a symbol. Oh my god. Okay, so we've got a lot to unpack here. So as far as scaling goes, 14 and Shoutsu. So good. Holy rap. Wow. Wow. Okay, so the the only differences that I can see with this uh, picture right up there, thank you, Tony, uh, is that Yamcha might be a little taller than he needs to be, but that is OG Yamcha. We don't have a new Yamcha yet, but maybe he'll be smaller. I don't think so. And then we have got the the full powered Goku standing in front here. Review coming, I promise, one day soon. Whatever. Probably not. Probably probably not soon, but it's coming. And then the 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 biggest thing that I, I take away from this is Tien is one, Piccolo needs to be taller. He does, but it's okay. We we went over that in the review on the last one. Vegeta looks way too big uh, on on the screen here, but we're, we're focusing on Tien. Tien and Chiaotzu. Chiaotzu is perfect. Chiaotzu is absolutely perfect when it comes to, to scaling here. I do like that Tien is taller than Goku. That is cool. Um, and uh, as far as like where, where trunks should be on Tien's shoulders, perfect. Perfect. So... I, overall, I'm very happy with this Z Fighter pose. So, guys, we we got a lot. We got a lot to uncover. So, we have done articulation, pay apps, and sculpting accessories, and size and size comparisons. So, this isn't really a, a, a thing, you know. Um, Tony said this was a good idea. I don't, I don't think so. Roll, roll, roll the clip. And gentle co-lectors, are you entertained? I gotta ask this because I'm uh, I'm curious. What what are your thoughts? What what how how you feeling? Are you are you under the impression that you need to buy a new TN just to have Chiaotzu? Do you care about Chiaotzu? Are you happy about the sash? Let me know in the comments below. Me on the other hand, oh. <laughs> It's hard to say, man. It's really hard to say because his joints are stiff, like super stiff. I don't know what it is about the QC with these guys lately, but uh, not not the greatest. The legs haven't really changed, but I will say that my my old TN has a lot more posability uh, compared to this guy. He's he's stiff, but maybe it's just because he got it out of the box. And uh, a month or two from now, he'll be fine. I don't know. I don't know. 
Chiaotzu, on the other hand, um, doesn't come with much, but honestly, I think it makes this figure. I, very, I really do. Uh, I like I like the fact that we get like almost an art articulated little statue. Like he's the perfect size, the perfect width. Um, as far as Tien though, or the width, <laughs> he thick, he not thick, he a clown. Can't be thick if you're a clown. Well, we're not gonna get into that. So, I don't know, man. I like the TN, I really do. The face plates, I would say, are the make it or break it on this figure. And uh, specifically, interchangeable heads make it. Totally make it. The rest of the articulation, his limited mobility, like the lack of ab crunch because of the giant cummerbund and then also the the sash the sash and the cummerbund are just fighting tooth and nail to try to make things happen and they won't work uh so it's like i know my rating scale is hate it like it love it got to freaking have it okay so i don't fully love it and i don't just like it so it's like kind of like it love it uh, is, is that a thing do we need to introduce more ratings into into my rating scale here like he's he's a good figure if you don't have a tn i would recommend picking him up 100 percent. if you do have a tn maybe i guess unless he's like your favorite character and then the chiaotzu chiaotzu make it or break it on this i think it makes it but guys if you like those shots going on over there in between the break, head on over to the Compton underscore on Instagram. Give him a like, love, follow, whatever you got to do. You know the drill. Honestly, let me know in the comments below what you thought of this figure. Is it, does it meet your expectations? Or are you like, I like the TN, but I just don't know if I like the TN enough to pay that much. Because he is $80 because it's a deluxe figure. It comes with toy cups, the one wonder, the wonder big guy and uh, to like one and a half, one and a half figures. No, okay, so Charles Tzu's the figure. So let me know in the comments below. I'd love to know your opinions on him. And uh, if you haven't, if you like this video, please hit that like button if you haven't already done so. And uh, you, you thought this video was helpful, hit that subscribe button and why not <laughs> make it a two for one notification deal and hit that little, 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 little bell up top there and uh next week so this is the new one uh for the week so next week we're going back to old um and chronologically speaking i think it's gonna have to do with numbers how about spoilers no no spoilers just hints just hints but guys thank you so much for watching this and until next time compton out uh